Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll show you in, in just a little bit how I made this. This is really difficult because oh <laughs> okay let, let me show, show you how I made this I I'm going to uh, take a little bit can you hear me <laughs> all the way from here Uh, first I have stick like this and on the computer I made a little model that how long the each rib should be and I cut these pieces like this like this and then this was the little ribs on front of this leading edge now inside the leading edge this was also cut from this stick and then let me show you using this. Let's pretend this is the uh, let's pretend this is the rib. This isn't really shaped like it, but uh, I first I got take uh well, what did I do first? I have to think. Uh, oh yes, I put two-sided tape on this surface and I stack them all, all, all in same stack. So they are st as straight as possible and then I surf uh, sand this font surface as flush and as I can. But uh, as it turns out that, that wasn't really good idea because they surface didn't come up uh, come up really straight uh, it was curved like this and it was curved like this it wasn't straight so that's the first thing i i'm going to do now differently next time uh, uh, the next thing that i did did uh, i used this hacksaw and i shaped the this surface a little bit so it's curved just a little and then I finished it with sandpaper and then I separated all the parts with knife uh, also I cut this other this other this and this part I finished them both and so they are all the same length uh, then, then I separated the two-sided tape with uh, knife, and so the, the all the ribs was stacked in, in little piles. I'm trying to do this, and <laughs> you can see me. Uh, uh, then I finished them each with sandpaper, and then they, they were ready for glue up. Sorry, did I? Is this too loud when I, I'm right here next to the uh, microphone, or rather the webcam? Uh, let me break my <laughs> fuselage file and add this. Uh, what's next? Uh, well, this is trying. I have to find a piece of paper that I can Replace this just a moment. Mm. Can I use this? It's, I think this is a little bit too small. Let me try it on. It might just. No, it's too mo too small. It's just barely. Uh, Fits, but I'm a little bit afraid that 
I'm going to mess this up. Well, let's try it anyway. <laughs> Let me put this away just for a second and cut away this paper. Yeah, it's okay. Ah, I always forget to put the cap on the glue bottle. Incidentally, incidentally that hasn't been a problem yet, but uh, actually it has been dried up for me one time, but I could peel off the little plug that has been de developed in the glue bottle. Oi. Ah. Oh god damn it. I forgot I had to my dad had a little bit better silk paper than that than this is and I forgot to <coughs> get it so I have to tomorrow get get there and ask for it. Okay, this is trash. And how long should it be? Let me see. This is plenty of space. Let me cut it from maybe from here. Okay. Let me get the straight edge towards this side that is going to matter then we are going to use this glue stick and glue, up, glue this paper on but before that I'm going to wait, wait just a little bit that the glue dries actually this little let me show you actually there's just this little gap here, can you see it? Oops. Here's, here's good. So, I'm going to cut that away to make it completely flush. And <coughs> then, I, then I'm going to just, just a little bit sand this surface, make sure these are completely flush. And then I'm going to Put the paper on. Yes. So what was I thinking? Oh yes, I'm going to wait first. <laughs> yes, so. Uh, let me show you actually. This is, in case you have, have, haven't seen this. Oh, I haven't shown you. Yes, the front side has a crack, but I, I'm not going to do anything with it because uh, I actually have been I have been repairing it, and I think it works. Let me show you the leading edge. Uh, it's a little bit hard to see, but. Uh, okay, that's a little bit better. There's the crack right here. And there's glue actually been I patched it with glue and I have been sanding sanding it so it's rounded nicely. So that's not a problem. Uh, thanks for ask, ask, asking me actually. Uh, are, are it's always better to be <coughs> Doing this with many, uh, how, how should they say, it's, uh, many people overseeing it, so they can uh, spot the odd thing that the other one didn't notice. Uh, 
So about this, while this glue glue dries, I'm going to show you this. Uh, I I made new one of this. Uh, Uh, yes, this was a little bit smaller in the previous version and I made bigger one so it stays level a little bit nicer and uh, I also shaped it like an airfoil. It's upside down airfoil, it provides downward thrust or, thrust, or lift so it keeps the nose up all the, all the time. Also, uh, there's two degree uh, angle right here. It's pretty hard to see. Let me get right on your face and see if you can see it. It's barely noticeable, but there's two tricky, tricky, two tricky, two tricky, <laughs> difficult word. Uh, it's there's two degree angle right here. So. It's pointing like this, and it was like pushing the tail down. And also, I said this a little bit previously. It was just a, a square, square. And now it's little bit shaped. It's not that much actually. I could, I could actually work it a little bit. Let me let let's do that actually. I'm going to <coughs> shape the. trailing edge of this uh, rudder Oops. just carefully pulling away this material I have to be careful not to cut myself but uh, This is actually easier to do like this in the, this direction. The problem is I can get really uh, nice place where to put my thumb and get leverage. Oh no, I'm cutting into the. <laughs> this is. This isn't quite really nice lead right now, but oh no, this is going really bad. <laughs> oh no, let's let's do it in this direction. Uh, do we have to glue this back together? We could. There's a little bit of splinter here. Let me do that. Now how I'm going to do this? I, I'm going to take just a little bit glue here. That's enough. And I'm going to open the splinter and shove this glue in here. Okay, that's good enough. I hope. <laughs> and here's one of these little clamps I'm going to use. Uh, let me let me take away more of this excess screw and put it right here. Yeah, that's nice. So <coughs> then that we are going to just sand it smooth. Other side, it's it's little bit sharper actually. I'm going to send little bits just from the tip. Oh yes, now it's really sharp and really 